Hey there. So, as you all know, I'm sorry I have this on my phone, by the way, but as you all heard, yeah, the guy who played Pad Black Panther, Chadwick Bosman, I think that's how you say his name, just passed away recently, and I'm just out of shock of words right now. I mean, honestly, I thought 2020 was a lot worse, but honestly, this tops it all. Like, this, I officially hate this year. I really officially hate it. So, it's like, Chadwick Bosman? Really? The guy who plays Black Panther? Never would I wake up hearing that today. Like, real. Well, my mom had to, like, you know, spill the beans on me, so thank you, mom. It's like, really? Really today? Like, okay, so I found, I don't know how many weeks ago, but I found an article saying that fans were suddenly, you know, worried about his appearance, you know, him looking all frail and skinny, walking around the streets of Hollywood, and, you know, fans were, like, commenting on that, and I was just like, I, I wasn't even worried at that time, you know, I was just like, okay, he, he's probably doing, he was, like, busy doing a movie with Spike Lee on Netflix, so he's probably gonna... He's probably gonna go to the gym. He's probably gonna stop get stop being on a diet and like eat more metabolism. You know, gain some more weight just to get ready for Black Panther. I was like, er everything looks fine. What did I didn't know for today that you know, like I didn't even know he had cancer. Like I didn't know he had kept that a secret this whole time. Like really, cancer? Oh my god! Like, like. I'm just a, a shock for rewards, man. Like, and the thing is, we're not only losing a great actor, we're losing the rising star as well. Like, I, like you can tell that he was gonna be one of those people who would change Hollywood by heart, you know, like change Hollywood from, you know, more diversity. Especially with more diversity we're getting in Marvel, you know, thanks to him. It's just. I, I, I'm, I'm just speechless. I literally am just speechless. I just... I just wish that 2020 wouldn't be those, this painful, you know? So, Chadwick Bosman, my condolences to you, your whole family. We're... We'll miss you. And now Marvel's like thinking about whether they should continue on with Black Panther 2 or should they cancel it. I, to be honest, I don't know. You know, like I'm already seeing like fans already saying like, no, like they should not continue this. They shouldn't continue with, with the story of Wakanda at all. Like they should just leave it to the ground. And my thing is just like, well, like I, I don't know. Like to be honest, I really don't know where they should go with it now that Chad, Chadwick's gone. Uh, like, do they cast the role? Of, do, do they recast the role of T'Challa, or do they, do they bring a new new guy? Like, we really don't know. It, it it really is a shocking time to be hearing about this. When there's just like so much story left about Chadwick, Chadwick's character. So once again. So once again. Rest in peace, Chadwick. We lost a tremendous character. We lost a tremendous actor in you. And I'm sorry that it had to end today. Or, you know, earlier. So, that's all I got. I have to get ready for work, so... I just wanted to put this out. And we, from the bottom of my heart, and from the rest of these Marvel actors, you know, who've known you... Even Kevin Feige, even, you know, Ryan Coogler, I think that's how you say his name. We're gonna miss you, man. We really wish this didn't have to happen today. Honestly, I can't do the other arm, but Wakanda forever. Take care, Chadwick, and rest in peace, my friend.